Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to Beer Geek Nation. I'm your host, Chris. Thank you so much for joining me once again for another beer review. And today, guys, we're looking at one of my personal favorites and a beer I'm going to review every year it comes out. This is the 2012 batch of Bourbon County brand stout from Goose Island Brewing coming in at 15% alcohol by volume. It's basically a massive imperial stout aged in bourbon barrels. And this year, Goose Island really stepped up the production. I think they said they brewed five times the amounts. I know Chicago where they're based and got hosed last year. They're getting 10 times the amount they got last year. It's currently only in Chicago, but it's dissipating throughout the country as we speak. So you're gonna be able to find this if you found it previously, comes in four packs. With that said, one of my favorite beers, just let me get into a glass. Do you guys know how it smells, tastes, and give you the verdict on the 2012 Goose Island Bourbon County brand stout. All right, guys, so the appearance on the Bourbon County style, it's ridiculously dark. Again, pours like, you know, hot fudge at like a Sunday fountain or something like that. No light getting through this thing whatsoever. Very, very little head to speak of. If there's any head, it's around the edge of the glass and it's a dark mocha, you know, verging on a brown. Tight white bubbles, definitely where the head is present. Lots of lacing on this one. Tons of alcohol legs. But at 15%, you're going to get that no matter what you do. Decent amount of carbonation in this one as well. Yeah. I mean, it just looks like the biggest, darkest Imperial Stout you can find. All right, guys, the aroma on the Bourbon County brand Stout. Yeah, big, big vanilla notes from the bourbon. I mean, that's the first thing that streams out of this glass. A nice oakiness, that woodiness definitely in there. A little bit of that toasted coconut that you get from a really, really good bourbon barrel. Lots of chocolate, some cocoa in there, some coffee. Nice kind of dark fruit, maybe a dark uh, pitted fruit, like a cherry or a plum. Definitely getting some of the alcohol on this one, a nice kind of sweet uh, al alcohol flavor to it. Really just a very, very complex smelling beer. All right guys, so the taste on the Goose Island Bourbon County brand stout 2012, cheers. It's such a fantastic beer and it seems to get better every single year. Right at the front of the tongue, you hit those big imperial stout notes. You know that bitterness from a cocoa, a dark chocolate, a very, very dark chocolate, espresso type flavors coming through. Middle of the mouth, getting front to the middle of the mouth, you just get hit with huge amounts of vanilla, this coconut from the barrel, the vanilla from the bourbon barrel. There's a slight, again, a slight ashiness, almost like a dustiness type of flavor to it. It's kind of hard to explain, but definitely um, like a prickly type flavor. Big, big sweetness in this one. You know, it's a dark fruit, fig, uh, pitted fruit type of sweetness in there. Middle of the mouth to the back, just more sweetness, more vanilla, more coffee, dark chocolate. Definitely, definitely, definitely feeling the burn on this one. 15%, I would expect that you taste that alcohol, but it plays off the vanilla really, really nicely. Plays off the bitterness from the chocolate flavors and the coffee flavors in this one perfectly. Super sweet finish. Um, again, more fruits, figs. That aftertaste of that plum and dark pitted fruits in there. Big sweet finish on this one. A just big, massive bourbon forward beer. Just awesome stuff. All right, guys, so the final verdict on the Goose Island Bourbon County brand stout 15% alcohol by volume. Like I said, guys, this is one of my favorite beers. This is one of the beers that really got me into bourbon barrel beers. This is an A plus for me. It's a world class, you know, well crafted, um, engineered. Uh, just fantastic beer. It's balanced, but at the same time, it's just so in your face and so extreme. If you love bourbon, you're going to love this beer. If you're not a big fan of bourbon, try this beer anyways. It's just huge amounts of vanilla, coconut from the barrel, playing off a perfect, perfect imperial stout, big chocolate coffee, but at the same time, there's a massive sweetness to it that really helps to kind of counterbalance, you know, some of the uh, the burn from the alcohol and plays off that alcohol really nicely. With that said, getting an A plus from me, awesome stuff. Definitely check it out. Definitely trade for it. Thanks to everyone who has sent it to me, by the way. So with that said, getting an A plus from me and more folks, life is too short. Drink amazing beers. Cheers.